Now this rocked the political world today. Ohio Senator Rob Portman says he won't run again in 2022. Portman made that announcement this morning. Our Mariel Carbone tells us where the decision came from and what it means now for local Republicans. Well, the senator says that he stayed in office longer than he ever actually intended to. Now, he's leaving at the end of this term to spend more time with family, but he also says the current political climate is playing a role in his decision. He spent the last 30 years in public service, but recently... It's a tough time to be in public service. It's one of the reasons why Senator Rob Portman says he won't run for re-election in 2022. But honestly, it's gotten harder and harder to break through the partisan gridlock. Portman started serving in the Senate in 2011 and will end his term in two years. He's passed more than 140 laws to date, many focusing on drug addiction and recovery, including the STOP Act, which prevents drugs like fentanyl from being shipped from China to the U.S. through the postal system, and the CARE Act, which expanded and funded education, treatment and recovery services. Those people whose lives were saved, we'll never know. But I know it made a huge difference. We're losing a giant. Tom Sinan, Newtown Police now, Chief and policy. member of the Hamilton he County Addiction Response Coalition, worked closely with Portman on those laws and says the senator built a legacy around addiction. I'm an optimistic person, but I got to say I'm a little concerned to lose somebody like Senator Portman when it comes to addiction. Uh, no one has fought harder than he has. And I don't know who picks up that mantle. Uh, you know, I think it will be hard very candidly to find. Uh, Alex Triantafilu, head of the Hamilton County GOP, says he expects there to be a robust primary among Republicans vying for that seat. That is going to be a highly coveted seat. As far as what qualities a person needs to actually win it. Rob Portman is a wonderful, wonderful senator, and he is really, uh, you know, I think what we should be looking for here in Ohio. That is someone who. Uh, gets things done in Washington, is reasonable, dignified, classy. And Senator Portman says he does still have two years left in his term, so he really plans on spending that time putting all of his energy into passing legislation. I'm Marielle Carbone, WCPO 9 News.